Hello and welcome back to the Super Cool Show. I got Super Kaylin on the line. Hello. Hello. Let's go. Oh, Tosha. I don't even know what I was saying just there, but let's go. Didn't say anything. It didn't. Zero it wasn't percent. a word. There was zero words said. So let's just keep okay. on keeping on. Which officially makes it super racist. Which officially <laughs> makes it super duper racist. <laughs> I see a little tunnel entrance up there. But I don't know. Is this the part where I rewind time? Dark Hind Watch. I don't I don't know what it does. Because I still haven't gotten to whatever the said, um, whatchamacallit was, the plant that we were supposed to be destroying. So yeah, I do actually have to use, I have to use the Dark Kind Watch to get to the beginning. Oh, cool. Sinister Grotto. Oh, oh, but I can't go back further than this. Oh, interesting. Return to current time. Oh, you can always go back to where you were. Interesting. It's all sweaty. It's, yeah, right? I was sort of doing the same thing. Oh, you know what? Maybe I have to use him as a springboard. Oh, here we go. Now I got it. Now I got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Not a worry. Go into there. And down. Sweet. Oh, and we're back in water. Oh, there's things above there. What? Right? Talk about thinking outside of the B-O-X. Definitely thought you were going to say B-hole. That's... That's in not... That's not what I was going to say. <laughs> What are you laughing at? <laughs> Just looking at you examining the level. Oh, it doesn't kill you. That's pretty good. Unless you touch a bug. Uh, uh, uh. Th I am totally hosed. 100% hosed. I am Jose Cuervoed. Mom says two. You're saved. <laughs> You say- I saved! I did! Just have oh. to do the boss all over again. How do you even- How does- how does one- how does what even- Oi vey. Can you explode those mines with- No, you can't shoot them. Oh. Dude. I know, I sort of had the same thought. It was like, but was like no, but but was like nope. That's not how that works. Oh gosh, oh. just just murder me. Don't do that. He didn't mean it. <laughs> oh, don't do that. He didn't mean it. <laughs> So how late you going tonight, cutie? You going was, all night? Uh, all 24. night long. Huh? 24 hours. 24. Gonna go all night long. I could do this all day! <laughs> Speaking of new girl. New girl reference, everybody. I hate that this thing is spinning backwards. It upsets me. <laughs> Just makes it super difficult. Oh, you. 
I just saw you not quite succeed at that. It's all good. It's like I was saying about the physics changing underwater. Oh, I made it! Nice! Without getting hit there. That feels good. Feels nice to finally do it. Yeah, being on water is super different. Right, it's just so Especially different. Especially because it alternates between the two. Right? Was the last one? Um, no, the most of it. Battle? No, the boss battle was over water. I wonder if this next boss battle is going to be underwater. <gasps> that would be weird. But would make total sense why all of these puzzles have been underwater. I mean, this place is called the Sinister Grotto. It's just like Ariel's Grotto, only super sad. It's like, it's like Ariel's Grotto, except everything is dead and or dying. And or wanting to make you dead. Oh, all the faces you make, they're cute. Huh. I just wanted to point out your bias. Hey man, other people, it is a proven fact that other people like your faces too. We've heard it from numerous viewers. So, your parents. And Grelly Bean. <laughs> and Grelly Bean. And Grelly Bean. Man, what the heck happened to Sea Mantis and Grelly Bean? Those guys were like the beginning of the positive vibe chat experience that is the super cool show today. Oh, do subscribers, subscribers, are they still on the list? I, I'm what pretty sure they're still What bothers me is vibes. I can't see who is subscribing to you. As a person who is like, who has liked you, the follow button thingy. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> Who's following you? You can't see who else is following. Yeah, you can. You go to my profile and then you click on uh, following. Not. You so I feel like I tried to do it. It's almost stuck. <laughs> oh, it's definitely right there. It's definitely just as easy as you made it seem. <laughs> but half of these people don't even have iPhones, so it's just a bunch of little lightning bolts. <laughs> What about little lightning bolts? Me and Grelly Bean and Sea Mantis are still subscribed to you. Yeah. They just don't like us anymore, I guess. They just don't <laughs> like us anymore. Uh, I need to get past this without getting hit. Ugh. All good. They have. Dude, and Sea Mantis has his own video gaming freaking YouTube channel now. Very nice. You inspired. That's I, not true. Not I just. Yeah, I'm like, I'm not even sure that it was me. I just, I feel like cool. Good for like, you for pursuing it. It's super right. fun. Yeah, like I, I really, I subscribed to his channel. By the way, I, there's, if you enjoy what you see, super cool. Also has a channel. Um, but there's a, a channel for a guy named C Mantis. That's S E A M A N T I S. See Mantis? Huh! Oh! Ah, man. Gotta not panic. Sorry, I, I made it too. Go subscribe. Go, sub go see subscribe Mantis. to See Mantis' YouTube channel. And go subscribe to mine. Because seriously, I could use the subscribes. Yeah, and if you miss anything, you can catch up on there. Catch up on, uh, catch up on that stuff. Get it. And this will be posted on there. So if you're participating, you can go and watch yourself. If that's what you're into. If that's if that's what you're into. If you enjoy listening to me be have awkward silences again. <laughs> I made it through that puzzle. Hurrah! Yeah, buddy. We did it. Great. Now the puzzle's even harder. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> okay, so I have to go. 
I have to go here. Follow this with me. I have to go underneath, up and around, shoot the thing, back through, up and over, and to the right. Did you get a save point before us? Yes, I did. Okay. Okay. Yep. Good luck to you, sir. I appreciate that. I already tried once. And I've got the right idea. Um, oh, I was really close that time, actually. At least there's a lot of gifts. Like, they're kind of big, so you can kind of move around. You get multiple whacks at it. Right. I'm just glad that there are so many freaking save points. I feel like the only reason that I'd rather do angel mode than this mode is because there'd be even more save points. Because mm -hmm. Lord knows I need them. Hmm. Ugh, gotta be so precise. Oh, you know what? Maybe maybe I'm not supposed to go up after that? You know what? I'm not. I'm supposed to go through. Oh! This game, though. Nope. Go, go through here. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay, now don't screw up. Nope. <laughs> Gotta do it again. That's okay, I can totally do this again, not a problem. Oh, what? Do you, do you see what I'm saying? Yeah, I was like, I don't even know what you mean, go through. Because you don't have enough... Right, exactly, I'm about to say. It shows you the thing up there, and you just assume that you have to do it, because it's there. Although, I'll bet you, up there is a freaking secret. If, so if you're a total boss, you can go up there. Be a total boss. You want me to? You want me to really grind this out so that I get that? Always grind it out. Never not grind it out. When in doubt, grind it out. <laughs> what? Yeah, what? The super cool channel. We do not not grind it out. We we do not not. We, we do also... not look at an opportunity to grind it out and then not grind it out. <laughs> also, we do not not use double negatives. I, I don't think it can be done. I feel like I actually did that just about as fast as it can be done. Not with that attitude. <laughs> Thank you, Evan Walsh. Oh! Yeah, you might be right. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I got a little bit close to that time. Can you flutter and jump once you once you go through instead of going up? No, oh, but that's too far. That's too small a space to land. Right. Oh, oh, bad. Bad. Bad, 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 Maybe this. it's a place where you end up falling through after going up or something. Yeah. Right. It's a part of another map. I'm sorry, but your princess is in, is in another castle. Mm -hmm. My princess is in Long Beach. Oh, it's just so adorable. It's gross. <laughs> it's so gross. Just get out of here already. Made it through. Okay, now let's actually go back and let's see if we can. No, no, definitely can't. Here we go. Oh, a little minecart action underwater. Wait, how do you? Wait, wait, what? Wait, what? Wait. 
people. You mean I'm supposed to... Okay, here's what I'm thinking. I'm, I'm thinking I'm supposed to get onto the minecart. Can you slide over there? As it's... No, you can't. Otherwise, this game would be way too easy. <laughs> um, oh, I forgot to start the timer again. Gosh darn it. I keep forgetting to do that. It's okay. We started up again at like... Um, 9.50 or so. 9.50? 9.50. So I'll just add 22 minutes. And... Sorry, um, what I'm thinking is we have to go onto the cart. We have to drum, drop under the cart, flutter over, jump up, shoot the shoot the laser thing because we can stand on that little ledge, slide through, come back. Oh, gosh. Okay, basically get this started. That's That was bad. We're going to try this one more time. Oh, this part's going to be so hard. Uh, 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 uh. Wait a minute. Oh, uh, yeah, I totally can. Oh, weird. Does my cart just fall off? Yeah, the cart, if it hits any kind of wall, it just falls off. Mm. Oh, seriously? Oh, but I can go underneath. Okay, this is just, this. pressing this button is just so that the cart will get through, so the cart becomes important later. Mm. Oh, I hit the button too fast. I actually was too efficient for once. Awesome. Dude, nailed it. Oh, 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 I did it! How did I... <laughs> I did it and then I totally messed up because I... No. I wasn't anticipating actually doing it. Always expect success. Rule number one of Wings of V. Always expect success. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Oops. Oops, oops, oops. Okay, let's give it another chat. Give it another shot. Another shot. Ugh. Oh, I get hit too much. Gotta not get hit so much. Oy vey. So what's a... Okay, what's another good... What's another good... Get to know Devin and Kaylin question. Um... Favorite book you've ever read? <laughs> <laughs> and Kaylin is like my marine biology text textbook last night. Um. I don't know. I don't think I have a favorite book. I really don't read. I don't read a lot unless I have to. Well, I mean, ever read a any book you have ever read? What has been your favorite? I know you don't. I don't. I don't read either much. This may seem really messed up, but I actually really enjoyed this one book that we were, had to read for. I think it was like honors humanities or something, and he had to read it during the summer. But it was this short book. It was like this girl's description of. Or like first person view of the Holocaust, or like oh. being in internment camps, or what no. was it? That sounds super interesting. One of those camps, and it, it was dark was it and it was farewell very to Manzanar. No. Okay. I don't know. I have kind of dark fascinations when it comes to my kind of stuff. So Fifty Shades of Grey is Aww. your favorite book ever. Well, you said no. dark fasc fascination, so I just went there. You That's... Know. Of course you did. You would go there. Dude. Oh, come on. I totally landed on that. 
Oh, that lip is so small. Dat precision platforming do. Um, well, one what of my you? favorite books yeah. <laughs> um, was like the whole Ender's Game series. Orson Scott Card's The Ender's Game. And I know that I have friends who would tell me to continue to support uh, homosexuality hate, but um, I, I think that those books are just magnificent and you can go and enjoy and buy those books and not feel bad about it. Um, supporting a man who doesn't understand how love works, <laughs> in my opinion. <laughs> oh, t t Devin Henderson tonight making enemies. <laughs> oh. And friends. I'm trying to look for the book. Are you sure it wasn't? I mean. Yeah, you would know. I remember reading, uh, I think it was in 7th or 8th grade, reading Farewell to Manzanar. And that was definitely about, like, Japanese internment camps. But that wasn't about the Holocaust. You were you were talking about the Holocaust. Yeah, I'm talking about the Holocaust. You're not talking about the Diary of I don't even Anne think Frank. it was about Auschwitz, either. I think it was about another one. Like, the second most popular internment camp. Gosh, I don't Alright. We're gonna we're gonna like Oh yeah, that's pretty cool. We're gonna we're gonna change the way that our uh, our V looks. Cause, Cause I'm I'm tired of being I think I think we're gonna go with robot. Alright, robot. No, we are not gonna do that tail. We're not gonna do that tail. We're not gonna do a tail. I don't want any tails. How about some wings? Oh, the amethyst wings are pretty cool, except they make no sense with the robot face. Oh, I think it was called Night. Let me see. Let's keep the ponytail. I think the ponytail is nice. These well, are the same. Yep, this is it. I think. Oh, do I have any companions? Nope. Yeah, this is it. Let's take off the halo. Let's take off the halo. Let's put on a bow. Let's it is a little bit about Auschwitz. Let's let's do what that the Ira wings. Ira wings. Yeah, and it was really short too, but just like really like good descriptive narrative. It was oh, it was good. Here, we're gonna be like a little cat with some different wings. Yeah, man. Oh, you look so cute. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Look at me, little cat with wings. Actually, this is really nice. I'm so glad that they have this feature in here because I feel like I would get really tired of looking at the same. Actually, that that execution was a little bit better. I feel like because I don't I don't feel like I take up as much space. Yeah, you think the outfit is a difference? Well, I mean, maybe not technically. I feel like technically the out outfit doesn't make any difference at all. Just in my brain, looking at yeah. something fresh. Sometimes that makes a bunch of difference. Oh, almost. Oh my gosh, we should play a little big planet together. Little Big Planet? So fun. That may be like one of my favorite video games. Little Big Planet. Oh, okay. And that was on what? That was on GameCube? Uh, PS2? I played it on PS3. PS3! <laughs> we're gonna have to we're gonna have to upgrade systems if we're gonna play that game, unless like Steam has suddenly started. Oh I mean Dale has PS3 we can play. And that's can play. Oh, I was so close again. But if you want to stream it, that would be more difficult. Yeah. Well, I mean, I we don't have to stream every single game we ever play. <laughs> I, I just assume. <laughs> That's... I, ooh, that was bad. That was bad. Huh? 
but I appreciate that. Yeah, I mean, streaming is fun and all, and of course they'd love to see your cute face. I I know that they would uh, love to see your cute face. I would love to see your cute face. Uh, I would love to see your cute face too. You we're being gross again. Stop it. Okay, ladies and gents, it has been like a month or something, maybe a month and a half. Yeah. A month, a month, a month, a month and a half. You're talking about since we got got engaged. Since we no, since we last saw each other. Oh like, oh. Maybe like a month, I think. Dude, long distance is the worst. It's the worst. So I have not seen Devin in person. Which, you, I see him a lot on Skype, but sometimes all you need to do is be able to see the person in person, and it makes you feel a lot better. It's nice to see the person in person in person with the person. Person with persons. I mean, personally. That's what I like to think. If you're personable. Huh, no! Ah, I was so close! <laughs> I have no idea what I'm going to do next after I get through this step. But once I figure it out, we will all be good. Oh, oops. That was so good, too. Well, that's good questions. What about your favorite restaurant that you ever ate at? My favorite restaurant ever. Oh goodness gracious. Um, Donovan's, I think. <laughs> I think <laughs> Donovan's is right at the top of that list. I love good, like a good big meaty steak. Ugh, so delicious. I love steak. Um, I also really like hamburgers. I'm trying to remember where like one of the best hamburgers I've ever had was, but. Just not coming up with it. It's it's in like Central California. I'm just not picking it up. It was in San Francisco. Uh, Red Cable Car Burgers, something like that in San Francisco. And I actually think they're closed down at this point. They they had signs all up said that they were closing down. Oh no! I know it was really a bummer. Um, what's yours? Your favorite restaurant? Oh goodness. That's a difficult task. So like, so maybe, maybe with this, like your favorite food and then maybe your favorite place that serves that food. <laughs> that might no. make it worse. I, was I don't good. really know what my favorite food is. I think if I had to pick one, it would be like something traditional in Japanese that my like bachan only makes or my mom only makes. They, yeah, that you can't find at a freaking restaurant. restaurant. <laughs> or at least you wouldn't want to. Yeah. Fair enough. Uh, I do enjoy really good sushi. Oh, yeah? Obviously. I was just watching a video today about how to properly eat sushi. How do uh, you I'll, know? I'll tell you, I'll tell you my findings after after you finish answering the question. Uh, favorite sushi place. Ha, mom knows my favorite food. She's like, Ozoni. Ozoni. She knows. She knows. Um, and ladies and gents, Ozoni is a traditional Japanese dish that consists of mochi, which is a rice cake in kind of a soup with some veggies and lots of different places in Japan make it different ways with different things in it. For instance, my grandma, who is also Japanese, makes it with a bunch of veg vegetables in it, so like carrots and things like potatoes and all sorts of other Japanese vegetables, whereas my Bachan, who's on my mom's side, my other grandma, will make it kind of with just some green leafy vegetables, and that's about it. Oh, I gotta do that too. Okay. Well, I got past okay. the first step and on to the second step. Oh, gosh. But when I think of like the nicest places that I've ever like enjoyed food, 
like I think of like Ruth's place. Ooh. That stuff's delicious. Like and super. I, think, I almost like that better than Dominic's. There's just not many convenient locations. There's one in uh, Anaheim. Yeah, there's one in Anaheim, and then there I haven't been to that one. And then there's one in San Diego, of course. Oh, that's, yeah, there's a Roost Chris in... Is it in... It's uh, right before you get off and go to the 56 from the 5. So instead of going straight to the 56, you actually to go right at that stoplight. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah, I see what you're saying. It's like down the street a little bit away, I think. Yeah, I think we... Have we driven past it? <sighs> well, I, mean, I don't we've... see why we would unless we were going to it. We've driven past it on the freeway. It overlooks a freeway. Oh, this part is so difficult. Yeah, jeez. It looks over the freeway? Yeah, it overlooks a freeway. Yeah, really good steak. Um, yes, I have had a Roos Chris steak uh, for free. I, I work for a fairly popular California-based fast food company that I will often tell stories about. Um, and for, like, our safety award one year, we got to go to Roos Chris for free. That's so nice. And I got to have a, I got to have a freaking Roos Chris steak for free. Mm -hmm. Ah, shoot. Wasn't low enough before I There's this really good place that we went to that I want to take you in Del Mar. Uh huh. That I forget what the name was. But we went there with Priscilla and her mother and my parents. Oof. It was really, really good. It's kind of Italian, but it's like it's like one of those super hipstery places that just use like really fresh local ingredients and make the most awesome flavor combinations and amazingness. Yum. Sounds good. Yeah. I'll try and take you there. What else? Oh, I actually hit... I didn't realize that you could hit that. Huh. Um, so I watched this video about how to properly eat sushi today. Oh yeah, tell me what you learned. So, okay, so it was this guy, um, he's a sushi chef in Tokyo. And he told he told the this white guy that was doing you know this blog spot or whatever um, that when you eat sushi rolls you're supposed to eat them with your fingers and you're supposed to lightly dip one end of them into soy sauce and don't shake it out because if there are drips just let it drip um, and then sashimi like the you know the little slab of fish with the rice on the bottom. You're supposed to tip it over sideways so that the fish is on the side and you've got the little blob of rice on the side. You pick it up um, and kind of like tip your chopstick sideways and dip the fish in the soy sauce once and don't shake it off yep. and, and eat it that way. Um, and then I think you were never supposed to combine the ginger and the sushi ever. Like you would eat the sushi and then you would finish the sushi and then you would eat a piece of ginger, like with your fingers. Um, and I'm trying to remember, there was one other thing But I'm not remembering. I, I yeah, I just don't remember. But that's I. It was funny. I've gone and I've eaten sushi with you so many times. I was like, oh, I'll never, I'll not learn anything here. And I was like, really? You pick up sushi rolls with your? You're supposed to pick them up with your fingers? You're supposed to yeah, pick them I don't up pick by the seaweed with, with your fingers. fingers. You don't? I don't pick them up with my fingers. My fingers are nasty. But, I mean, with the sashimi, I thought you were supposed to pick up the sashimi with your fingers. And yes, like, fish side down in the soy sauce. And then you're supposed to put the fish side down in your mouth as well. Right, 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 heard. right. Yeah, I, do, I think he also said that. I just forgot to mention it just now. Yeah, I just don't eat sashimi very much. <laughs> Culminating emota. <laughs> Mom typed out the restaurant that we went to with Priscilla. It's called Cucina Enoteca. You're welcome for that. Thank Beautiful you. pronunciation. Enoteca. 
Cucina Enoteca. And that it's was... supposed to be, like, Italian. Right. Ish. It's so good, though. That stuff is good. They have a... It's like a short rib pasta. It's got, like, a short oh, rib ragu. What happened? I was doing so well. Oh, I'm so sad. Oh, you just slid too far over. Well, yeah, I jumped. I pressed A accidentally is what is... No! Oh, But wow. yeah, thank you, Mama, for the... For the... Clarification. Clarification. The thank you, specification. Devin, for the clarification. <laughs> on the clarification. The clarification. Dude, we're, we're on this inse uh, clarification inception here. This inceptification. <laughs> Specification. Oh, that was hard. Specification. <laughs> Specification. Specification. Spe 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 <laughs> that's difficult. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. That's amazing. That's. I was so close. <laughs> I enjoyed the face you made too. I just saw my number. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here. This is the part when I slide. Oh, wait. Can I just. Oh, I can just stand. Ha! Oh! That's not fair! <laughs> Did you see that nonsense? <laughs> Oh, <laughs> terrible side squirrel. It's like, dodge this. I'm like, ah, 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 ah. You're supposed to slide? No, you're supposed to get off and flutter. Like, you're just supposed to walk off, flutter, jump, jump, land on it, and jump up. Oh, That's messed up. Right? Tell me about it. Nope. Not that time. Ugh. By the end of this, I'm gonna be a professional at this section. No, down! Down! Oh, one mistake! Made up for! Okay, and I can just stand here on this. I don't need to do anything. <laughs> that was my mistake last time. It's like, phew! All right. Nope. How are you supposed to? Oh, you know what? Maybe you just have to, maybe you have to get off forward, flutter, and then like wait until you're at the very bottom, which would be in the very corner, and then just jump twice up. Oh, this is gonna be, this last part looks really easy, but it's gonna be really hard. <laughs> Ah, come on. Nope, not this time. Not this time. Anyways, uh, what's next? What's next? What else What else are we talking about? So we've gone over favorite foods and favorite restaurants. The restaurant you have eaten the most at in your life. I mean, and I'm, I'm talking about, like, restaurants, not, like, Burger King. <laughs> and I think, I think Panera gets to count. Like, think, oh, yeah. think back and, like, what's your most visited restaurant? I don't think Panera is it. I feel like Mimi's Cafe is it. Or, like, Marie Calendar's. There was, like, a time where my family was just going there because, like, we didn't know where else to go. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. We're just like, and they have everything. So, why not? They have everything for everybody. You're getting really good at running through this. Very smooth. Um, what about you? I think one of the 
one of the restaurants I've definitely been back to the most is Olive Garden. And that's because whenever there was a missionary, like, that would visit our church, we would take them out to lunch. And mm-hmm. Olive Garden was sort of just the place that we went. Either that or um, we would go to Super- Black Angus. What? Yeah, right? And the church would pay, and we would get to eat delicious food. I think my that's love... That's the place you've gone the most? I guess you guys don't eat at restaurants a ton, right? Oh, I just got saved by taking damage. Hang on a second. Oh, that was an oops. Um, no, we didn't tend to go out. My parents, my parents would cook most of the time. Um, yeah. But like every oh, you know what? No, 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 no. That's definitely not it. There was over by a soup plantation in San Bernardino. There was this Chinese food place. Um, it was a Chinese food buffet. But it was actually, like, it was really good. Like, the Chinese food was actually really good. And, I mean, I suppose Chinese food is not that hard to do buffet style. Mm -hmm. But they did it really well. Yeah. We actually have a Chinese food place that we would go to a lot. That may be up in that list as well. Yeah. But we used to go there, like, every single Sunday after church. We would go there and we'd meet our friends, the Redikers there. The Redikers. Wow. My mouth. It doesn't believe that Z that G's exist. There are no gangsters in my mouth. Oh, what the? Oh, I pressed pause accidentally. Darn. That was a really good run too. Here, let's let's watch it happen. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Did you did you see the brilliance of that run? Like how clean it was. Yeah. Mm, but yeah. What else? Yeah, I think that is the first couple of things I come to mind. Huh. So yeah, so Chinese food <laughs> and and Marie calendars. Hey. Yeah, and this Chinese place is like family owned and really nice, honestly. Like they they've done really well and they've survived for very long. Well. Nice. And we know them. They they're know like us sort as of, a family. Right. When one of us say. is not there, then they say something. They're like, "Where's the son?" Oh, oh yeah, Where's yeah, yeah. Daughter? You told me. Where's your daughter? You've told me about this place before. Yeah. Where's Where's the daughter? <laughs> your parents should just be like, "She died." Oh no, that's not nice. <laughs> It'd be so sad. Um, okay, here we go. Here we go. We got this this time. Get oh, it. Nope. <laughs> I fluttered too soon. Ugh, I love that these mines are here, and I haven't, I have, I haven't hit them once even. Definitely hit them. Oh wait, those the first the, like the first mines. three, yeah, the first the three second. mines. I was yeah. like, not the second set. No, 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 no. The second yeah, set, I have a hundred percent hit, <laughs> like a bunch of times. Speaking of food, I should go get some food soon. Right? Oh, what are you gonna get? What are you gonna get? What are you gonna get? At this time of night, probably junk. I think uh, In and Out is open. In and Out is indeed open. Speaking of. Uh, Fairly famous California based fast food chains. Mm-hmm. Oh, what the. Mm. Um, yeah, and I'm thinking of going until 11. 11 o'clock. Alright. And then. and then finishing it out. And picking it up wherever we were last time. Oh gosh. I would really like to get this puzzle done. <laughs> oh. If there is stuff after this before a boss, I'm just gonna like disown this game for <laughs> a couple of days. Mm. Bing, bang, 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 bang. So now that you are done with your first full year of graduate school, and that sounds cool. That sounds awesome. That's that sounds pretty cool. Thanks for putting it that way. Because that's totally 100% what it is. Um, what are you going to do this summer? Oh my goodness. Land? I'm going to go to Disneyland. 
<laughs> um, it may be true. Well, shoot. I, I mean, my fiance and I are going to start freaking putting together our lives together. <laughs> Uh, hopefully go and look for a new apartment that's in a nicer area of town. Um, and of course, for those of you who are watching this on the YouTubes, the, the lady on the other end is my fiancé. <laughs> this is, this is Super Kaylin. Say hello. <laughs> hello. <laughs> um, so, I don't know. We're gonna do that. I'm gonna, like, come and visit you as much as I can. See you as much as I can. I'm gonna work a ton, save up money. I'm gonna wedding be stuff. Teaching. We're gonna be working on our wedding. Ugh, jeez Louise, I'm losing Not it. Not too man. much stuff. There are certain things that we need to kind of reserve early on, but other than that. Yeah, we're gonna be going in two weekends to go look at venues. I'm super excited about that. Hopefully, we decide on. I'm excited. I think. I actually saved it, but I couldn't save myself. I yeah. think it'll be easy peasy. You feel like it's going to be easy peasy? Yeah. All I know is that it's going to be a blast. And I hope that when we go and we tour the Bernardo Winery, they give us food. Fine. Oh, well. Oh, uh -huh. oh, well. I hope they give us all of the free stuff. Be like, and if you come here, you can have this wine. We'll be like, oh yeah, we can have some of that wine. I'll be like, <laughs> no! Oh, I so pressed it in time. Ugh. Oh, yeah, we are coming up on break time here, real fast. What the? What? What? Devin, the floating head, had me <laughs> this is the last one too. Hmm? <laughs> I just said the last one too. Devin, Devin, the floating, the floating head, Andrew Henderson. <laughs> Andrew, middle name, the floating head. <laughs> my, that's what all my friends call me in school. Hey, floating head, how, how you doing, floating head? Keep forgetting to jump. I need to jump. We've only died 123 times, not a problem, right? <laughs> Zero problems. Um uh, Alright, what's next? What's what is the next? Okay, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. We gotta do this part. We gotta do this part. We gotta do it right. Oh! I hit the roof. No! Um, let's see here. What is it? What is it? Let's do... Oh, gosh. Um... Favorite place in the world and why? Uh, Switzerland because it's quiet and beautiful. Mostly quiet. Mostly beautiful. Mostly All quiet? Of both. Yeah, Switzerland. And it has Zermatt. Which is awesome. What is, that is Zermatt? The, Zermatt is the mountain that is um, right next to the Matterhorn. The real life Matterhorn. <laughs> so, it's the mountain right next to the ride at Disneyland, right? Yes. It's basically what you're saying. And it looks exactly, the Matterhorn is at Disneyland looks exactly like it in real life. Nice. 
So wait, you're saying that the Matterhorn ride at Disneyland isn't the actual Matterhorn Mountain? Is Matterhorn a mountain? It is indeed a mountain. Teach me about geography. It, I mean, it's a mountain in Switzerland. And it's beautiful. And awesome. Huh. And I hiked it. I hiked Zermatt, the one and parallel. And they're both, like, I think Zermatt's a little shorter, but it's not. It's not that much shorter. <laughs> and it's cool, and you know, you can take a picture with the Matterhorn in the background, which is awesome. That's and cool. Beautiful. And I am a shutter bug. And so I was like, ooh, pictures. So, right. You were like, oh my goodness, it's a mountain to go back to. That was exactly what you sounded like, right? Mm -hmm. How old were you when you went to Switzerland? The I land of all things sophomore. Nord. I was a sophomore in high school. Sophomore in high school. Dude, I was a sophomore in high school when I went out to Ireland, one of the favorite, one of my favorite places in the world that I've ever been. Very um, nice. It was serene and gorgeous, and there were lots and lots of sheep. Aww. There was cows in Switzerland. They had their little bells on their neck. <laughs> good old dog, good dog, good dog. Is that... Is... Is Switzerland the Nords? Is that... Am I... Am I totally fibbing about that? Uh... I don't think so. You don't think I'm lying, or you don't think that's a thing? I don't think that's a thing. <sighs> this first part is such a challenge. Oh my goodness. What are the Nords? Nords? Like, that's like, um, like old, oh, gee, I'm gonna just sound like an idiot here for a second and stumble over all of my words. Um, it's like old, gosh, Nordic. What like is, Nordic people? Yeah, okay. like Nordic people, right, the Nords. <laughs> Sorry, you are using an abbreviation, so I was like, I have no idea what that means. I'm looking at it. Hey! Obviously. Whoa! Whoa! Hey! Whoa! Hey! Whoa! 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 Did you do it? You better freaking give me a checkpoint. Oh! Okay, we, we made a it. checkpoint, and then we're going to take a break. <laughs> we are going yeah. to take a quick break, and we'll be back in just a minute with some more Wings of V. So you take care, and I'm going to find out what Nords are. We'll be back yeah. in about five. <laughs> Alrighty, let's put on some music. Wait, I have you. Yeah. 